Hello everyone. Welcome to Rising Leo VFX. Thank you everyone for making my channel to reach 100 subscribers. From now there will be regular videos. Today we will create this call out using motion tracking. Let's dive into tutorial. Insert your video in Natron. Adjust your project settings. Make sure your project resolution is same as your video resolution. Set your frame rate to 24 frames per second. Press tab and insert a tracker node. Attach the tracker node to video and viewer. Click on Add Tracking Point and select Tracking Object. Again click on Add Track Point button to disable it. If everything is set click on Track Forward button. If your tracking stops it means there is error during your tracking. To check the error click on Show Error button. The red points indicate the error. Adjust the tracking point and track forward again. In this case the error again occurred. Just track backward frame by frame. Try to track forward if error occur repeat the same. I am ok with the tracking now. Go to transform options in tracker node. Select motion type as much move. Set transform mode as transform. Go down and click on export. This will create a transform node. Disconnect the viewer, and connect a roto node. Select Pencil Tool and draw a call out line. Enable the colors and go to Stroke Options. Adjust the brush hardness to 1. Click on select tool to adjust the point position. Adjust brush size to 10. Insert a transform node to move the call out line.
Select Center Interact. Edit your text. Insert a merge node and attach it to text node and roto node. Attach transform node to merge node. Now you can move the part freely. Now insert another merge node by pressing M. Attach B wire to merge node and A wire to transform node of the tracker. Attach merge output to the viewer. Now connect tracker transform to call out transform. Adjust the position of the call out. Resize brush size to 5. At frame 25 insert a keyframe visible portion end. Set its value to 0. Now at frame 40 set value to 1. Add animation to the text. Go to font size and insert a keyframe at frame 30. Set font size to 0. Move few frames forward and set font size to 30. Now check the preview. It's done. If you like the video hit the like button and share the video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram and Facebook.